In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to export your IdenTrust digital certificate so that you can upload it to the One Notary platform. Once you have gone through the steps to purchase and retrieve your IdenTrust digital certificate, you will then need to export that digital certificate to your computer so that it can be uploaded to the One Notary platform. To do this, you will first need to open Google Chrome. You will then click on the three dots in the upper right hand corner. Next, you will select settings. On the next screen, you will go to privacy and security. You will then scroll down and select security. And on the next screen, you will scroll down and select Manage Certificates. The Certificates window should open and you should be on the Personal tab. You will then need to select the certificate that you want to export. There will probably be two certificates listed here. One is for encryption and one is for digitally signing documents. To help determine which certificate is which, click on the certificate, click on the view button. On the next window, click details and then scroll down until you see key usage and next to key usage, you should see digital signature. That is the certificate that you want to select. You can simply press OK to close that box. Again, make sure that you have the correct certificate selected. Click on Export and then click the Next button. Be sure to select yes, export the private key and then click next. Make sure that the include all certificates in the certification path if possible box is checked. Make sure that the export all extended properties box is checked and make sure to not check the delete the private key if the export is successful box. Once you've made the proper selections, click next. On the next window, make sure to click the password button and then enter a password for the certificate. Then click Next. On the next window, you will need to click the Browse button and then select the location where you would like to export your digital certificate. You will need to give the certificate a name and press Save. You will then click Next. On the next window, click the Finish button. And if you are prompted for a password, enter your password that you normally use for your certificate. You can then close out of all of the windows. You should then be able to locate your digital certificate in the area that you designated.